Hi guys, it's Davis Burnside of the Tri-City Storm in the USHL, and I'm currently committed to play hockey at The Ohio State University. I went to Bridgedale for three years, and it was truly one of the best experiences that I've ever had. Bridgedale helped me improve my academics and taught me many life lessons. In addition, it helped me develop my hockey skills and my overall game. I would recommend Bridgedale to any young student athletes as it's a great opportunity and experience to have. Thank you so much. Hey guys. It's Matthew de St. Fault, the Chicago Steel. Uh, I went to Bridgedale in 2015 to 16, and I'm heading to the University of Wisconsin next year. Just want to say that Bridgedale is an amazing place. Uh, every day, from the workout room to the on ice to the classroom, uh, it's truly a unique experience and something that a lot of kids dream of. So, uh, if you guys get that opportunity, I, I'd say you jump on it. Hello, I'm Christina DePali, Academic Dean at Bridgedale Academy. I also teach 7th grade literature, grammar, vocabulary, and spelling. I'm one of the founders of Bridgedale, and I am extremely proud and passionate about shaping and guiding the lives of young men who walk through our doors. Like you, I am also a proud mother of two hockey-driven sons. I understand that boys at that age in middle school sometimes are not academically engaged, they're not confident in their abilities, they lose focus, they're, not, they're afraid to raise their hands, they're afraid to get, participate in class. And at Bridgedale, we all understand that. We have small class sizes, we offer individualized attention, and we offer a dynamic instruction, both on the ice and in the classroom, that help build a solid foundation for, for their future success. If you have any questions, if you'd like to meet with me, I'd love to answer any of your questions. Thank you. Hi everyone, I'm Josh Lapina. Uh, I played with the Lakin Stars the last two years in the USHL. I'm going to play college hockey next year at UMass Amherst, uh, where I got a scholarship. Uh, I only got a scholarship, not because of my play on the ice, but also because of my good grades in the classroom. Uh, I went to Bridgedale Academy my seventh and eighth grade year in middle school. Um, nothing but good things to say about Bridgedale. Uh, the, the coaches, the, the teachers, and everyone there is is there for you and, and they're there to excel you as a person on and off the ice. Um, one thing that really sticks out to me about uh, my time at Bridgedale was um, one of their core core values and identi uh, identity, um, and that's teaching everyone there the, how to be a good leader and, and leadership on and off the ice and everything you do. So um, everyone stay safe and uh, thanks. Hi, my name is Jack Silich. I went to Bridgedale for one year. I played at the Boston Junior Bruins NCDC last year, and this upcoming year I'll be playing at the Youngstown Phantoms in the USHL. And I am also committed to Quinnipiac University. My experience at Bridgedale was awesome. I learned a lot not only as a player, but as a human, and the growth through my teachers and the staff at Bridgedale. Hello, my name is Therese DeYoung. I am the primary math teacher for fifth, sixth, and seventh grade and I also teach eighth grade geometry and eighth grade science. In math, we use traditional textbooks um, with you know traditional ways of teaching, but we also put an extra emphasis on a consistent reviewing of basic skills so that we can achieve mastery through consistency. The reason I love Bridgedale and what makes it such a unique experience is the community that we're able to achieve. It, Bridgedale is like coming home. My coworkers are my family. My students end up feeling like family by the end of the year. And the relationships that everyone have between the parents and the teachers and the students, the administration, the ice rink, it really is a lovely environment that can't be replicated anywhere else. I've been here since 2013 when we opened our doors. So that makes it for seven years. And I haven't left since and I don't want to go. There's nowhere else I could get this experience and love my job. I love my job. This is why I love Bridgedale and it makes it such a unique, fun, beautiful place for your son to grow up in. Hi, my name is Sean Behrens. I went to Bridgedale for two years and I play for the U.S. National Team Development Program now. Bridgedale helped me become not only a better hockey player and improve my skills on the ice, but a better student off the ice too. When I was at Bridgedale, I learned a lot of valuable lessons that helped me in life and succeed where I am now. Hey everyone, I'm Andrew Maynard and I went to Bridgedale Academy from 2013 to 2016. I played junior hockey last year for the New Jersey 87s and this upcoming year I'll be playing for Tufts University. Uh, Bridgedale Academy was absolutely instrumental in my success both as an athlete and as a student and I'm very thankful for the opportunity I was given to go there. 
Hi, I'm Christy Flory. I've been teaching at Bridgedale for the last five years. Currently, I am teaching seventh and eighth grade algebra. On the first day of class, I'll always say to my students, I want you to be great at this subject. By the end of the school year, I want you to feel like you're great at algebra, not just good at it, but great. The way I foster greatness in my students is teaching them the habits that they need in order to find that success. Some of these habits include uh, taking notes, organizing a binder, quality homework, and most importantly, I test my students cumulatively. So every time they have a test or a quiz in algebra, anything we've learned from the entire school year can be on that test or quiz. And in this way, they're not just learning information and dumping it, but they're actually mastering concepts. The best thing about working at Bridgedale is the ability that we have to establish relationships with our students. We have more time in the class to work with them one-on-one. -on -one. Every student has an impact in the classroom. There's no one that can hide. Everyone participates every day. Everybody asks questions. Everybody goes to the board. Everybody is free to take risks to learn. And it's a, such a great part about Bridgedale. Also, relationships lead to more success and that success also builds character in our students. Hi, this is Wyatt Chingothi. I went to Bridgedale from sixth to eighth grade and it was a blast. Um, being able to play hockey at, your, at where you go to school is definitely something that a lot of kids aren't able to do. So um, I've been playing in Waterloo of the USHL for the past two years and I plan to go back for another season. Bridgedale Academy is a wonderful place to be. I've been teaching here for seven years since the beginning and the staff is knowledgeable, dedicated, so dedicated like I've never seen before. Compassionate, so compassionate. They care about each of the students. Our leadership is creative and understanding and nurturing and our students, all our students, they are fabulous. The curriculum here is quite challenging and robust, yet the students know what's expected of them and they get it done. They get it done here. They work hard and they learn a lot. They learn an awful lot here. I'm Mary Pat Murray. I teach ELA to the fifth and sixth grade students, English language arts, which is comprised of five components, spelling and vocabulary, grammar, literature, and composition. Our curriculum is full of fundamentals. It is steeped in fundamentals, yet full of meaning. The students leave here much, much better writers, readers, and speakers. The small class sizes, the dedicated staff, the compassion, the care that's taken for each student. It, it, it's the perfect academic environment. Hi, my name is Michael Prokos. I'm the history teacher at Bridgedale Academy. I've been here for about two years. I've been here since November 2018. So uh, I teach fifth grade through eighth grade, the history program here. And uh, we go over a bunch of different types of curriculum and subjects. In fifth grade, we go over sort of the 1860s American history in that aspect. We talk about Civil War, Reconstruction, slavery, North versus South differences. And then for sixth grade, we pick up right where we left off. We get into the Gilded Age. We talk about robber barons like Andrew Carnegie, Rockefeller, Vanderbilt, J.P. Morgan, people like that. We also delve a little bit into the Spanish-American War and World War I for that grade. In seventh grade, we talk about the ancient cultures, ancient civilizations like Egypt, China, India, Greece, Rome, uh, things like that. For eighth grade, we talk about the 13 colonies. We talk about the Revolutionary War. We get into the Constitution, the history of it, um, the three branches of government and the balance of powers, and then we take the Constitution test. After that, we get into the um, history of Illinois, talk about the Constitution for Illinois as well. Uh, overall, what I like the most about Bridgedale Academy is probably the small classroom sizes and the environment that we uh, foster here. It's When it's smaller, I feel like it's more personalized, which it fosters a greater learning experience. People don't fall through the cracks here. They receive the necessary attention that they deserve. And um, overall, the education here is very comprehensive and it does a great job of preparing the students for, for high school and beyond.